Okay, I need to know. We're on our way to Costco right now. Do you guys wipe off your lipstick before you put your mask on or do you just not care and let it get everywhere? Because I'm thinking that I need to wipe off my lipstick. I really don't want to have like my lip color like down here and up here and all these crazy places. So I'm going to wipe it off. Let me know what you guys do because I'm really curious. These are such a good buy. They're on sale for $9.99 right now, you guys. So cute. Okay, so option number one. We have the Dyson Ball Animal Plus Pro Upright Vacuum for $300. I like the purple detailing on it. Oh, it's so heavy. You want to feel the weight, babe? Oh wow. It's really heavy. <clears throat> this is option number two. We have the Shark Duo Clean Lift Away Vacuum with Self Clean Brush Roll. That's a name. I like the blue. Let's see, heavy. Ugh, okay. I'm just getting the drift that all of these are going to be heavy, so. But this one is 260. So not bad in price. Okay, this is option number three, you guys. It is the Shark Navigator Lift Away Upright Vacuum. I like the gray. I feel like it's really cute. And then it has, that's the lift away part of it. I think that's cool, even though we don't have stairs. I think that would be pretty cool to have. And the price is only $159, so love that. I think I like this one the best. I like the color of this one. The color is cool. The color is really nice. It's like very sleek, and that's kind of what I wanted in a vacuum. And it also has that lift away. Do you see that? This lift away thing? Oh, that's cool. There's a touchable plug. Yeah. What's the difference between this one and the other one? The $259 one? Yeah. I think it's just like a more upgraded version, maybe. Ooh, and it has LED headlights. That's really cool. So you can see what we're doing. Yeah. It says duo plane. Yeah. Part of your crevice tool. But I'm like, I don't need, we don't need something that's like super specific to pet hair, you know? Like big chunks on the floor. You wanna, you wanna put it under? It? Oh my God. We hang out too much, babe. How exciting, you guys. Oh, it fits perfectly. That's nice. Look at that, meant to be. Item number one on our Costco haul is ready to go. This is why you can't come to Costco. Costco's A about to, to get all of our money. $22.79. That's a really Each good roll deal. is usually like six bucks, six yeah. to ten dollars for one scotch roll. Yeah, that's a great deal. Wow. As you guys can tell, Ebony hasn't been to Costco in a while. So the Costco charm is working on her today, guys. Look at those though. Look at the paper mate, even the Sharpie pen. It's only 11 bucks for all of these. I don't like marker um, I do. Well. I like marker pens for like my planning and stuff. So $11 for this, that's pretty good. Need, that's a strong word. Okay, I see some organized Oh, wait, I've been wanting this for a while, baby, look. Come, 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 please. Look at this, so this is a, this is kind of a dupe for the other one. I don't know exactly what it's called. But anyways, it's $30 for a six piece storage set. That's a really good deal. Look it, I bought these last night. Look at there's literally two left because oh, they're only twenty dollars. So nice, it's really good quality. So if you guys see this at your Costco, you gotta pick it up. Let's go. See, because this oh, is the other one. Though. But I don't like all that. I don't. We don't need all that right now. I did really good today. What do you estimate? I guestimate about four fifty because we got the vacuum. 
Because of the vacuum? Yeah, because of the vacuum, I think that's gonna put us over what our typical totals are, which is like 200 bucks. Two to 300. Yeah, two to 300, that's what we usually spend, but I wanna say 450 just to be safe. So I'm not shocked at the checkout. Okay. All right, guys, let's go. Do you guys ever just have those days where you just feel so pretty? That is me today and I'm loving it. So I just finished filming my Costco haul video. So that's going to be up very close to this video. So if you want to see what I got at Costco, I know I took you guys along with me, but I didn't show you exactly what I got. So if you guys want to see that, make sure you guys stay tuned. And now we are going to get some lunch because we are so hungry. Are we literally the only ones that spend over $400 on food, almost $500 on food and then go out to lunch? Yeah, that's us. We are trying to find a place to go have lunch right now. It just sucks because everything is still closed like to eat there. So we're kind of stuck eating in our car, which isn't the best. But anyways, I'll show you guys what we eat when we get there. All right, you guys, we just pulled up to Plant Power. It is a vegan fast food joint. It is really, really delicious. I love that it's vegan because we usually get burgers when we come here and that's definitely what I'm getting right now. Um, so what I like about it is it doesn't make you feel like you feel after you eat McDonald's or even In-N-Out. I always feel kind of like heavier than I did before like going into the meal. So I really enjoy that it's vegan because I do feel like the ingredients are better and it's not as, you know, heavy. So I'm excited. The line is kind of long, so we're just going to hang out until we get to the front and then we will show you guys what we got for lunch. Can I possibly do the Rambler? The Rambler? Yeah, instead of the barbecue sauce that comes on it, can I do the Thousand Island sauce that comes on the Iconic Burger? Perfect. And then can I order an Iconic Burger? Okay. And then can I make that with the combo and a root beer to drink and fries as the side? With fries and then what would you like for the drink? A root beer. Okay. And that's it, please. Okay, so I have my... Ooh, I'm so excited. We have fries. Oh my god, this is so good. This is mine. This is the iconic burger. It is just a regular burger. Lettuce, tomato, pickles. Cheers, guys. First bite. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm. It's so good. Oh, careful when you pick that up. Okay, let me ask you guys this. Ebony and I are definitely not vegan by any means, but we love vegan food, right? So if you have ever tried Monty's and or Plant Power, let me know which one you guys like best. I like Plant Power best. I used to love Monty's until I had Plant Power and I was like, oh my God, this is so yummy and delicious and fresh. Ugh, so good. What do you think, baby? Monty's or Plant Power? I think, um, I like, Plant Power's bread better because it's lighter. Okay. But I like Monty's meat patties better. Oh, okay. Monty's fries are better too. Mm. Yeah, I couldn't. I can agree with that. But I just like the burgers from Plant Power. They're so good. And I also think I like Monty's cheese better. Mm. I don't know. I think Plant Power is a winner for me. Anyway, is he just not gonna look behind? All right, so as you could probably tell, I'm in my room, relaxing. <sighs> Sundays are for getting things done, but for also relaxing. <sighs> I think Eb is gonna take a little nappy nap and I'ma just chill, watch some flea market flip. This is her favorite drink, you guys. <laughs> it's the salted sweet, no, what is it called? I don't know, you order all the time. I don't know, I couldn't even say it to the Starbucks girl. I was like, can I please get the salted caramel here, try it. Maybe you'll remember what it is. Shut up. A salted caramel 
cold brew with cold foam. Extra and I get foam. Extra cold foam. And they got my name like kind of close. It says Dina. Dina. Close enough. Honestly, I need to come up with a code name from Starbucks because every time I go, uh, they're like, what's your name? And I'm like, Bina. And they're like, meh, me. They never know how to spell it. Anyways, we're going to relax for a little bit. And then I got to get up and clean my house. Laundry has to be done. So I think now is a good time to relax. The eyelashes are about to come off. Actually, let me just. Ah, that feels so good. Ah! <laughs> Dang, a whole different person, huh? All right. We're about to relax. I'll check back in with you guys later once I start cleaning my house. Bye. Hello. I am back. It has been pretty much an hour since I vlogged last. We hung out in the bed. We were relaxing, but I was like, you know what? My house is a mess and I need to clean it. This is usually, okay, we're about to get really personal. Okay, so welcome to my life. Um, I'm gonna show you my laundry room. <laughs> It's a hot mess, okay? We don't judge each other around here. So, it's kind of just honestly overall messy. But anyways, I'm gonna put my towels in the dryer. I'm gonna start new loads of clothes. I like to batch laundry, I guess, if you will. Just make things easier. Anyways, okay, here we go. Here's the laundry reveal. <laughs> okay, so we got some sheets. We got our new Tide Pods. Old laundry, new laundry. Laundry that needs to be put away. Anyways, so. Uh, let's see. So I'm pretty much just going to be putting all this laundry away. So I will check back in with you guys when I'm done. minutes there we go Woo. I'm a little bit blind so I can't really see um, anyways guys we're gonna unbox this are you guys excited because uh, I'm so excited and grateful to be having a new vacuum because if you visited me right now, my floors are definitely not vacuumed, okay? Because the vacuum we have right now is hot garbage. So, we bought this. I feel like an infomercial right now. So, we got the Shark Navigator Liftaway. This was the best value for the money. Great reviews online. It was $169.99 at Costco. So, let's go ahead and get this open and see how it works because I am excited. I don't think I've ever been more excited to unbox a vacuum before like what it says welcome to the shark family how cute quick start guide that's definitely what i need just so you guys know i'm the builder of the house ebony isn't so great at like building stuff but we won't tell her that um she usually is my assistant when i do this stuff but anyway we can figure this out right guys here we go piece number one here we go, check. Then we grab this bad boy. Bam! Ooh. Okay, good, 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 okay. You have to like really press it all the way down. If not, it kind of stays out. What's step three, guys? Okay, and then click. We got that. Should I move you guys back? Is that better? Oh yeah, that's better. Next, we got this. Ugh. Oh my god. Okay. Okay, this is like really user-friendly, so easy to put together. Love that for us. This kind of clicks here, so it's not just roaming all over the place. Oh, that's it. Let's test it out. 
out. Anyone that's using headphones, please beware. I'm gonna turn this on. I just wanna see for reference how loud it is. Oh, let's see, okay. Like a dream like it sounds so nice I thought I heard something let me see Obviously tell we are freaking out over this vacuum. It is so good. First impressions 10 out of 10. Look how many would look recommend. Like Let's already. see how much gunk is already in here. Oh my god. After just a little bit. Can you see? Oh, you can see it. Oh my god. I told you guys our floors were not vacuumed. Wow. You guys, I, I have to get off this camera. I have to vacuum the rest of my existence and I'll see you guys later because I'm so excited. You guys, if you cannot tell from these eyes, I am so tired. It's been a very long, productive slash lazy Sunday. I feel good. My office floor is cleaner than ever because of our amazing new vacuum. I hope you guys enjoyed that footage. We were genuinely excited about it. Um, anyways, it's 10 p.m., okay? The big 1-0, and I'm ready to go to bed. I'm tired. I have a lot of stuff to do tomorrow. Honestly, it's mainly cleaning. I've got a lot of cleaning to do tomorrow, but I love a clean space, so I'm excited to do it. Thanks so much. I hope you guys enjoyed. And